What's up guys, Father Mac here with another video. Uh, this one is No Man's Sky, let's go. So a little bit of background. Um, it's been a few weeks since I played this game, probably like a month or so. Um, was on a trip in Mexico, quarantine, all that good stuff. You know, I ain't saying those words because then the video get flagged, you know what's up. Anyways, um, last time I played this game, I had a little trouble. Um, it was the Void Egg update. Uh, I don't know if that is actually the name of the update, but everybody knows. Living Ship, Void Egg, all that good stuff. Um, every time I came close to, I think it's the second phase, second or third phase of getting, uh, of the Void Egg, um, the game would crash. I, th I think I remember doing it like two or three times in one day and the game crashed. Imagine how frustrating that is. Trying to use the coordinates, you know, to get to whatever position you need to, and boom, the game crash. So, TBH, I was going into this like, I hope this game doesn't crash because I'm going to get all angry on stream. And that's just, ain't nobody got time for that. By the way, yes, this is a video, just stream highlights, quote unquote highlights, because it was like an hour and hour and 10 minute stream just break it down anybody wasn't able to see the stream um anyways at this point i'm up in you know get out of the whip i'm just like hmm what's going on i'm having trouble finding it, finding where i need to be i'm looking at the coordinates i'm like yo i'm right here like it's gotta be here it's gotta be here so i think right here is when i sit down a beacon i'm just like yo i'm gonna remember this spot I think uh, I think I went up to the space station, did a little bit of this, did a little bit of that, whatever. But um, eventually, you know, I realized like, hey, what did I do the first time? Now, keep in mind, this is a day one save, right? So I kind of expect to have troubles with this save sometimes just because it's old, 2016. I bought the game the first day it came out. I think I even pre-ordered it, but anyways, thinking hard about it you know thinking hard about what i did what i was doing and you know spend some time in the space station because that's what that's what helps everybody you spend some time in the space station things come to you a little bit clear you know your mind clears up you're like wait 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 i know this so you know i'm strolling around on the planet and uh in the general vicinity of uh you know where the coordinates are and i'm like man it's got to be around here somewhere I take a look at, uh, you know, this damaged piece of equipment. And I'm like, do I need to open this? I'm like, no, no, I know it's not that. I'm like, what's going on? And I see that monolith there. And it takes me a second. I get back to my ship. I'm like, yo, hold up, hold up, hold up. Man, why you being such a dummy? Get out of my ship. I'm like, yo, it's the monolith, my brother. So let's head to the monolith. And all I can think is like, yeah okay now it's starting to make sense it's all good you know obviously looks like i'm in a corvax system so read along partial success achieved the bridge allows the implantation of consciousness shards from the discrete shells a little bit of this a little bit of that y'all can read i ain't gonna read this out um another thing too i messed up on my stream audio i was not talking loud enough during the stream that's why this is narrated right now just to give you a little heads up but anyways go through this the whole shebang as you can see if you take a look at my head on the video i'm talking 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 moving my head i didn't realize i moved my head so much when i talk anyways i realize i need one pulsating core and i'm like what is a pulsating core but as I exit the message, boom, get a new technology, get the recipe for the pulsating core, and I'm outraged that I need 250 of this. And you know, it, pulsating core, that's new. That came with this update, I didn't even realize it. Whatever. So, what I do next, I start flying. Next thing you know, boom, I see myself a little, uh, little deposit metal deposit looks like it's shiny you know if you play this game watch somebody play this game you know that's gonna be some metal boom what do you know liquid sun and i'm like 
I'll take it. Let's go. So you start mining. I parked my ship in a bad spot. End up having to move it. It's all good. So I end up mining. Finish that all up. Go to crafting. I'm like, oh, should I craft my exosuit? Craft it in my ship. Doesn't make a dang difference. No difference. So craft it up. Take a look at it. And I'm just like, oh, okay. This is what it is. Not a big deal. All in all, I head back to uh, head back to the monolith. Deposit the pulsating core. Grab myself, uh, I think it was some sort of, it said heart this, heart that, something. Anyways, what I really noticed was that it's going to take 21 hours. That's right, 21 hours. And you know, it's not that I didn't know, I just forgot that you really got to do this over the course of a few days. This isn't something you can punch out in, in two hours or so. So it's just going to take a little bit of patience. That's all. That's all it is. By the way, I hate these things. I had to blow this thing up before I went and deposit the pulsating course. So, anyways, that's pretty much that. Um, you know, tomorrow I'll be going back. I, I'll be going back to uh, the next step. So, catch me on stream tomorrow. If you're watching this video today, April 29th, who knows, whatever. The video will be up. You know what it is. I'm out.